Hello there. France have won the World Cup for a second time by beating Croatia 4-2 in the final in Moscow. Kylian Mbappe, Paul Pogba and Antoine Griezmann all scored, emulating the great French team of 1998, which was captained by current coach Didier Deschamps. He's only the third man to win as both a player and a coach. De Monstave, she would, uh... I had the immense pleasure and immense privilege to live through this as a player 20 years ago and it was in France so of course it will be marked in my memory forever but what the players did today is just as beautiful it's just as strong it's a personal pride of course but honestly that comes second I'm much happier personally to see the happiness of my players they are world champions Kylian Mbappe for example is just 19 years old and I do hope he's going to be a world champion again. I have extraordinary teammates and I know that I'm going to be in the history of French football with my team. We don't quite realise it yet. Our children will be very proud to have our names. We have to enjoy it now and we are trying to give a good image of France and French players. And I hope many young people saw the match and will do the same. Some consolation for Croatia was that their captain, Luka Modric, was named player of the tournament. But none of the players in the final could deny Harry Kane the golden boot. England's striker finished top scorer with six goals and returned to the UK on Sunday with the rest of his teammates and coach Gareth Southgate, who praised his captain. To show the leadership that he did throughout the tournament for us, uh, I was really pleased and really impressed. Um, there's the respect of all of the group. And I think his mindset of... Um, what's possible, what's achievable, um, as he's shown with his own game, um, filters through to the other players. Well, away from the World Cup, and Novak Djokovic is the.